$69 million is, is an all-in by the commission in saying, hey, we believe in Jefferson County, we believe in our future. That's $69 million all going to the schools today. The Jefferson County Commission presented that money to superintendents from the 12 school districts in the county. Welcome in. I'm Jim Dunaway. I'm Sherry Jackson. The school districts can use that money for whatever improvements they need. CBS 42 News reporter Jamie Ostroff is in Hueytown with how some students will benefit from the money. I asked Jefferson County Superintendent Craig Pouncey what he thought the biggest problem in his school district was, and he said it was overcrowded elementary schools. Here at Hueytown Elementary sit 10 of the county's 75 plus portable classrooms that have become the norm as of recently. But thanks to that county money, Dr. Pouncey hopes a lot of these will be gone soon. Ask someone with a kid at Hueytown Elementary what they think about the portable classrooms and they won't have many nice things to say. There, it's probably crowded, it's not a lot of space, and it doesn't seem like it's, it's conducive for learning. They're just an eyesore. I want them gone, and I want these kids to have a good school. But the trailers are necessary, as more and more elementary schoolers pack the halls of Jefferson County Schools. While the school district already revealed plans for nine renovations and seven new schools, a cool $24 million will help those plans move a lot faster. That money was part of a $69 million surplus. It was divvied up by the Jefferson County Commission and presented today to all 12 school districts in the county. When you ask those same parents about that, the comments are much nicer. I'm excited for our school. But to know that it's all being given back to the school to improve our children's learning environment, I think it's a great idea. The county commission said it divided all of that money up based on the number of students in each school district, and it's going to use that method to divide $18 million up between the schools every year for the next 25 years. In Hueytown, Jamie Ostroff, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.